your girl finally got the three minute feature so i'm gonna make a little get ready with me video i do have whitening strips on my teeth but only for like another couple minutes so starting off i'm just gonna put some spf on this one has a green base to it so it helps with redness i never have a go-to brow product so i always like try new ones um this one's from jason Wu beauty i've been using it the past few days and i don't know how i feel about it it's like a brush like this i literally just dropped it right on my silk pillowcase moving on from that it's like you just kind of paint it on i know it's gonna look really kind of weird at first because i haven't like combed through my brushes i combed through my brows i don't know i, I just kind of spoolie it in and like comb my brows i don't really know how i feel about it it's really easy to use but i think today's the day i realized i don't like this product gonna attempt to fix this with concealer brb i have bangs so they'll cover they'll cover my brows i self-tanned i don't know if you can even tell but because of that i've kind of just been using like a light and a dark concealer for my foundation and i use the elf hydrating camo concealer um does anyone else's do this it's like separating it's all red i feel like this is all over the place three minutes i think gives me too much time to talk um i'm taking the shade fair beige and just putting it under my eyes and then the shade medium neutral which is like the darker one and i just kind of put you know little dots around my face and i'm blending with my juno and co cloud sponge this is my favorite my favorite sponge always blend up upwards like this with the same sponge i'm just gonna go in and do the rest never heard anyone talking about using these like kind of as their foundation but it's so pretty and really hydrating so your makeup won't crack throughout the day i have combo skin for reference these are coming out i'm gonna hurry up since i don't even really have that much time um this is the juno and co blur powder my fave i'm gonna use the juno and co es12 brush and just set this my entire face I've been using this powder for like six or seven months now. I freaking love it. You already know I'm using the Pure X Barbie Malibu Blush Palette and my It Cosmetics French Boutique Number no. 4 Blush Brush, and I just kind of use all of them, and I blush contour. If you're new here, we don't use bronzer here, and uh, I just kind of do a big C shape like this. I'm going to take the Hip Dot Face by Cream Palette, and I'm going to use the shade Tiara, and I'm just going to- I'm running out of time. How am I running out of time? I'm going to put that on my lid. And then just kind of like fan it out. I like putting a light shimmery shade just on my lid. It gives me like early 2000s vibe. Okay, I'm going to curl my lashes and then I'm going to put on the It Cosmetics Superhero Mascara. For everyone asking, that's the mascara that I always use. And um, it's amazing. I love this mascara. I'm actually going to take the same eyeshadow shade with a fan brush and use that as my highlight. It's so pretty. Maybelline Lip Liner in the shade 125. And the Jason Wu Lip Plumping Gloss is amazing. I'm gonna go do my hair. I'll be right back. That's it. This is the final look. This feels a little anticlimactic considering it was a three-minute video. Just a very natural, glowy makeup look. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you like these kinds of videos. I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. I love you so much. Bye.